And now I'm going to show you some examples of some of the extra background commands that can help speed up insertion of uh, symbols. As soon as I pick up a symbol from the catalogue, when I'm holding it, there's a couple of extra keys which aren't so obvious, but you can make use of. X and Z allow you to rotate the symbol as you're placing it. And just above that, A and S allow you to reduce the size and S enlarge it. So that's Z and X for rotating, and A and S for the scale. As I come to place the symbol, I can also use one of two other letters, R, to allow me to define up to two lines of a symbol to place across a group of wires. So if I hit R, draw a line. If it's a single line, I get a single row. If I do the same thing again, type R, then I can actually define a box where it gives me two rows, top and bottom, and that will then allow me to place many more. So if I just window around those, give me a bit more space. Same thing again, so I've got Z and X for the rotation, A and S for the scale, R for up to two rows, and then finally L, before I place it, allows me to define a line either directly across or diagonally. And I'll see that it'll place as a single line. 